dumbbell curl right so when you normally do a dumbbell curl as you can probably see there we normally grip the, the the bar like that right with your fingers over and then your thumb over like you're making a fist and you simply you know bring the bar up you know bring it down easy right and of course that is activating your bicep but I want you guys to try this all right so instead of holding the dumbbell like in a fist I want you to take your thumb and just put it underneath the bar. So that's called a hook grip or a monkey grip. Now, what that's going to do is when you perform the bar, uh, the curl, it's going to take a lot of the stress and a lot of the activation out of your forearm and also out of your shoulder. And it's really going to place the emphasis on your bicep. So this way, you're really getting that uh, connect mind muscle connection with your bicep and you're activating pretty much only the bicep instead of forearm muscles and shoulder muscle as well now obviously with the normal grip yes that is going to activate the bicep and you can probably lift heavier because you've got a bit more um, front delt activation and the forearms are working <coughs> excuse me but the problem I see with, with that is sometimes your forearm gets tired before your bicep and so even though your bicep can do another curl your forearm makes you have to drop the weight and therefore by just doing that hook grip you can get a few more reps and burn your bicep out even more now the only downside to that is that you might not be able to lift as heavy weight but that's okay because when it comes to bodybuilding you don't necessarily always want to lift as heavy well you want to lift as heavy as possible but it's more about breaking down the muscle tissue now one last thing when you're doing that hook grip what I want you to do is try and at the top of the movement turn your pinky uh, outwards I suppose so if you can see I'm a bit closer normally you'd curl straight up right what you want to try and do is when you bring it up start twisting your forearm so that your pinky is going towards the outside of your body and I'll show you real quickly what that's doing so if you watch when you've got a straight arm like that right so my hands facing straight watch when I supinate how the bicep activates just like that and so the more you can turn your pinky out the more your bicep will actually engage. So, next time you're training your biceps, give that a uh, little tip a shot. Hopefully it helps you guys get a better bicep workout. Make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you all next time.